Hey everybody, welcome back to a new video. Today we are going to expand our sky block island to the borders of the world. Right now you can see. The last time I recorded the video. <laughs> after that I told you I will just show you how much I progressed in the next video. But after a bit of progress, <coughs> progression, like you can see all those farm and all wooden stuff. But after all of that. I ran out of resources and now this is how I am I'm going to work now. <coughs> Will you see that you pick it up? <coughs> then as you can see we can all pick up a campfire for some reason. I don't need the coal anyways. And look at this, I am suffering from chest monsters and these are completely like messed up. Look at this chest, like what do you think when you look at it? Like it's like a whole mess made up of chest. Today I am going to sort out all my stuff into different categories and try to make a home. Which I was not able to do so. By the end of it, actually, no, I'm just cleaning my inventory and filling every clearing every single sort of my inventory, like throwing away stuff and the chests, just to make this the rest of the room, like the rest of the island. Like I'm going to expand my island a bit more, like a half of my island, room. and then try to make a home, which I didn't make because of because of the server errors. Server just crashed and boom. You cannot make your home anymore. This is the only reason because the zone goes offline and I was not able to make my own home. But I do most of the stuff done, so that's the win. Take all these slabs, and we might need even more of these. Check the chest. Maybe there are some hiding wheels. When you are convinced there is nothing, you can go to the campfire and mine it out of your hands. Like you are breaking fire with your hands. Boom! I don't need both. I mean, charcoal. I don't need it anyways. So now we are going to mine out this whole area with the help of our hand. After collecting all the resources I would ever need to complete this place, I think I will. And by I mean, I, I don't know how long I can keep all the resources working. So I'm going to make a new stone generator because I am going to break the old one. And grabbing as much dirt and grass as I could. So right now we are just mining all this cobblestone and going to replace this all with cobblestone slabs. Which is why I am just collecting the resources. Like you all can see right now, this place looks very very bad. And now I am trying to find the buckets. So that I can just store the lava in them. Just because I want to store the lava in the bucket. I was trying to find the buckets which I don't know where I put them. I don't so I'll give it away to somebody I can say it for sure. I know I have not given my buckets to anyone. I don't know where should I put the lava in now. So after even after sorting all these chests I couldn't find the bucket so. I guess we are just going to craft all the new one for a new world. Look at this, I have one bucket of water. That's not enough for me. And a project. Like we need to collect all these three buckets of lava because I paid for them. Just because I didn't pay for the lava flowing right next to the cactus farm. I don't care about it. 
after by the end of the video we are going to be rich i guess because i am going to sell all the useless garbage stuff i have right now and going to get rid of it like look at this all these cactus it is 28 not too much not too less just enough for us to make a lot of slime dye but i don't need lime dye for now all i need is take out all the stuff as much as i could or maybe i should take all the yes i guess we have to take out the iron blocks and use it for the bucket bucket and oh am i added value 6 even though there's nothing special maybe because of the cactus farm it is or maybe because of the two hour buckets they are flowing I don't know why it is, but it is 6 on the reason. A thing that I can never understand. Now we don't need any lava farm because we already have a lot of lava, but still I want some lava farm because I'm just going to use the dipstone method to farm the lava. Like, yep, just to duplicate him. that works with the water too so this is the only reason why I'm going to do it here we go 11 I wasted it no I don't want to but I have to but we were just less here we go three buckets and two spare ingots now we can collect all the three buckets of lava we have here put them somewhere safe I don't want to make this video feel boring. We already have a bucket of water, so I'm going to put it in the cauldron. Because we need at least two buckets of water to make infinite bucket of water source. And here we go, we have right enough resources to make everything we would need in this world. Here goes the iron and the lock and the ingots both. And now as you all can see right now over here We will take out all the cobble of stone out of this place and put all the lava and water buckets we have in there And now I guess we should start with placing the blocks in the old fashioned manner or you can say in a fast time lapse there we go we are going to start it sell all the useless stuff in just 25 seconds so that the video would not be that boring for you all to watch like we have filled up all the half of it and sorted all the chests and sell all the useless stuff but alright when I was doing this and I just was making my home this message showed up on the screen and this is it because we cannot build anymore. Bye.